Hello YouTube, today we are at Champion Chevrolet located in Howell, Michigan taking a look at this all new 2017 Chevy Silverado 3500 HD. This is an LTZ trim level. This also has the L5P 6.6 .6 liter Duramax diesel engine with the Allison transmission. This engine produces 445 horsepower and 910 foot-pounds of torque. You'll notice too that it does have a functioning hood scoop to let more air into the engine so it can breathe, be more efficient, and give you more power. Beautiful 18 inch chrome rims. Six inch tubular chrome cab length running boards. You do have your diesel exhaust fuel cap right there. You do have the integrated step up with handle, which is very useful, especially getting into a truck like this because of its height. You have a huge hitch for towing. You got your seven pin and four pin connection, access to the spare tire, backup camera, easy lift tailgate, which locks and unlocks with the key fob. This does come uh, with bed liner in it, the spray-on kind, not the plastic kind, which in my opinion is definitely the way to go. This is the six and three quarter foot bed, I believe. You do have parking sensors in the back, your massive exhaust pipe. Chevy does this thing on the rocker panels, it's like a rough texturized paint that's to protect against rock chips and corrosion and rust. You also do get some plastic moldings there to protect the paint on the bottom. Here's a, a shot of the frame and the leaf springs. Chevy does use a wax coating on their frames. There's some more molding, there's some chrome trim. These are the power adjustable trailer tow mirrors with the turn signal, LED indicator, and blind spot mirror. This is one awesome truck, you guys. Let's take a look at that 6.6 .6 liter Duramax engine now. All right, here's a closer look at the 6.6 .6 liter Duramax. It is a massive engine. Here's both of your batteries. EGR, air intake, absolutely beast of a truck. Now the hood scoop, the air comes out from there into here. Look real, there you go. And I believe this is a bleeder um, to let out water from the hood scoop. Massive engine, like I said earlier, 445 horsepower. 910 foot-pounds of torque. This thing can pull down a, a house oh. or a train. You do have your rooftop clearance lights as well. This being a Z71 LTZ. Let's take a closer look at the interior of this beast. All right, starting on the driver's side door, just like the Silverado 1500, you do have storage here as well as here with two cup holders. Uh, you do get the Bose 10 speaker premium audio package with this. Again, the carbon fiber looking insert, uh, memory seats, uh, child lock for the doors and the windows, window controls, lock and unlock, and your mirror controls. Getting in again is very easy with these chrome running boards. You do have Z71 logo right there. Power adjustable seat. Coming over here you have your dimmer for the instrument cluster. Lighting controls. Uh, two high, four high, four low. Trailer brake control. Uh, tilt and telescoping steering wheel. Get up and do it now. Something that you'll notice about this is on the 25 and 3500 it comes with the grab handle unlike the 1500. You have the carbon looking inserts that transfer throughout the uh, gauge clusters. 
something cool about the 2017 model year is there's a little um, speed limit sign right there if the road is detected um, on the maps it will also show your speed the speed limit that you should be going um, that's a really cool feature definitely helpful if you don't know the speed limit and uh, can save you from getting a ticket coming over here we have cooled seats just the seat back or both seat back and seat bottom which is very nice to have or heated seats again you control it right there and the three LEDs indicate what one you're on you have an 8 inch touchscreen with 4G LTE Wi-Fi uh, this has been updated uh, it now includes uh, it now includes Apple CarPlay as well as live traffic which is nice to have and I believe live up-to-date weather reports right here just like in the 1500 you have your physical buttons for the media down below that you have all of your HVAC settings these this is your adjustable pedal button uh, forward or down traction control on off this is your cargo bed light this is your parking sensor assist uh, off and on hill descent control and the exhaust brake coming to this massive center console which I love you have two USBs two 12 volt outlets and a 150 watt plug right here you have a two tiered um, phone holder so you can put it on the front one or the back one it stays up regardless which is very nice I like that a lot and then you have a very deep um, storage bin right here which is nice two cup holders if you have an Android device or a device compatible with wireless charging you can put your phone on there and it'll charge it up for you this by far is the biggest deepest center console I've seen you have a 12 volt right here along with two more USBs and an auxiliary you have a tray right here for pens or whatever very nice very generous in size I'd say that's probably a foot to maybe 14 inches deep you do have um, cord management right here which is always nice to have making our way to the passenger side again it is cooled seats heated seats you do have two uh, glove boxes this one can be locked with the vehicle key which is nice this one just has the books and stuff in it you know average size passenger door you got storage there storage in the, behind the two cup holders you do get the Chevy floor mats um, with this vehicle uh, my personal favorite thing about this vehicle is the tow mirrors in my opinion I believe Chevy's got the best tow mirrors for the heavy-duty trucks absolutely beautiful um, coming back over here you do have a lit vanity on both passenger and driver a upgraded um, bigger size glasses holder lights on off control uh, moonroof controls as well as sliding rear window up top and you have a universal garage door opener that can support up to three garage doors so now that I showed you the front let's take a look at the rear and see how much room we have all right I'm in the back of the Silverado 3500 with the seat adjusted to where I would sit I'd say I have a solid six to seven inches of legroom before I hit the front seat uh, keep in mind I am 5'11 you do have storage behind the driver's seat and passenger seat which is nice coming over to the door you have the carbon fiber looking insert again window control storage and a cup holder I like this way more than the double cab I would definitely recommend getting a um, crew cab if you can you get a lot more door space and you don't feel nearly as cramped coming to the middle uh, you have a minimal uh, transmission hump which is nice having a having to deal with a big huge hump kind of is annoying in my opinion you have storage right here storage up top and then a 12 volt outlet right there these seats do fold up which is nice you do have lights back here and your grab handles 
to fold the seats up. You just kind of pull, push on the seat until it's back. Uh, they do kind of give you the, like a concave um, hood liner, roof liner, so that way if you're standing something up back here, you can easily do that. You can easily fit a 55 or 60 inch TV back here standing up. Let's go to the bed. Like I said earlier in the walk around, easy lift tailgate, backup camera. It is, um, does come with bed liner, Chevy logos up there. Very nice truck. Let's, uh, I'm going to give you an exhaust note and then I'll show you the window sticker. Here's a closer look at the window sticker of this vehicle if you can see it. There is privacy glass, so I'm sorry about that. Uh, this is a 2017 Silverado 3500 single rear wheel, four wheel drive, crew cab LTZ. It pretty much has every single option you can get. Uh, standard vehicle price is $52,625. Sticker on this vehicle as spec is $68,345. Uh, because this is a heavy duty vehicle, it is not required to go through um, EPA fuel economy tests, so it is not listed. If you're interested in getting this vehicle or a vehicle like this, come down to Champion Chevrolet located in Howell, Michigan, and talk to the salesman Devin Stone. He's a real good guy. He'll get you set up with what you need. Uh, they can order you one if you like one, but it's not at their lot. They can have it shipped to their lot. Real nice truck. Thanks for watching and subscribe for more.